Noon, the safety train has made its way to Hampton Roads. This morning, emergency responders across Hampton Roads received hands-on training aboard a Norfolk Southern train. And Casey Baylor shows us how this training will protect you. Responding to a rail incident isn't the same as any other emergency. The equipment is exponentially larger in every sense. And it's important for first responders to understand how it all operates. Very rarely do we get an opportunity to have such uh, hands-on um, interaction with this type of equipment. Lieutenant Marshall Smith is one of about a dozen first responders from Chesapeake, Portsmouth and Norfolk learning how to respond to any railroad incident, including what to do if there's a hazardous material spill. 99.9% .9 of all hazardous materials get to destination safely, but in that rare event, we want the community to be prepared. For the last six years, Norfolk Southern has used this safety train as hands-on training for many first responders on how to respond to rail-related incidents, and it also provides them a new environment. They're used to dealing with containers that are not as substantial as a rail container. They're also used to being able to control their environment. They can set out road flares and cones and stop traffic. Tuesday morning, first responders learned about each valve and locomotive on the train ready for any unlikely event. In our area in Chesapeake, we frequently have trains that go uh, through our areas. So it's important that we be able to mitigate any potential situations that happen. The training is also offered in the Cincinnati area and Kansas City, Missouri.